a deal like this. Speed is not to not the deal. It's uh, being able to still do it. It might take a little longer, but you got more time than anything. So. Rheumatoid arthritis is a terrible thing. You can put up to three bales up there with this thing. And see how it falls off. We have. This guy's got a five foot two. Ready with arthritis to put the hay up top of the trailer. This track will fit in any trailer, flatbed. Trailer, flatbed truck, pickups. We have numerous different hitches you can use. The three year old, the noise doesn't bother him, but sometimes moving the saddle when you haven't got a hold of it bothers him a little bit. He'll get used to that. It's a lot easier to train him to this and take that electric chainsaw and cut his bridle path. Here she is letting it down, then she can walk all the way around it, not bother him, and unhook it, and then just swing it away, and her horse is saddled. She's undoing her rigging now, getting it straightened up. Now she'll let it on down, unhook her her saddle rack and move it out of the way and she's saddled up ready to put her rigging together. There you go, that's the second time she's used this lift. Done riding. She's only five foot three. This is a young horse, a young colt, and he's just doing the best. And I'm nervous. Like I said, this is our new trailer. It's the second time she's used it. And she's putting her saddle back together so she can lift it off of there. She has rheumatoid arthritis in her hands, so it's hard for her to do anything with her hands. But you see she's gaining. She's still doing it. There she goes. Now she's going to talk to him. Her saddle rack back out. There we go. She come in off her ride. She's going to talk to him. Put him back up there. We always bait him with a little feed. Feed seems to be the secret on any horse. To bait him. There we go. Now she's going to lift it off, swing the saddle out of the way. And she's going to drag it off of him. Good colt, good colt. 